We're here this morning with the rest of the Episcopal Church, with the presiding bishop, with the House of Deputies, with the House of Bishops, to protest and witness here at the Hutto, uh, what's called euphemistically a residential center, where there are uh, children and families. Uh, lots of children have been separated from their families, and we're here along with the presiding bishop and the Episcopal Church to, to uh, witness to this injustice. It's been difficult. We walked up the road to the front of the detention center, which you can see over here, um, and we could see we could see little hands waving from the windows, and we waved all together, saying, "You're not alone." It reminds us even of the work that we're doing in our diocese of dismantle racism. It also reminds us that many state prisons are in our diocese, where lots of people are, are detained. Uh, we pray along with uh, the presiding bishop and the rest of the Episcopal Church that this injustice will be overcome and that we uh, can show our love and compassion uh, as best we can for people.